Broadcaster Steve Ryder revealed on BBC Breakfast today, Wednesday, October 11th, that he is battling prostate cancer. The sports presenter, 73, told viewers he was diagnosed two months ago and will undergo surgery this weekend. Former grandstand host and ITV football anchor Steve also shared how he was moved to go for a checkup after fellow TV presenter Nick Owen opened up about undergoing a prostatectomy, and a neighbor also received a cancer diagnosis. BBC Breakfast Today Steve said during his live telly appearance this morning, I'm a great convert to the work of Prostate Cancer UK because on Saturday I need quite an urgent operation. The whole process from getting myself checked, to diagnosis, to operation has taken about two months. I consider myself to be extremely lucky. Reflecting on his test results, Steve continued, my reading was a little bit high. But being a bloke, you can live with that. No symptoms or anything like that. My wife, thankfully, is far more sensible and far more tuned into these things. So we went off and into the examination procedure and into the x-rays and so on, and the biopsy as well. Steve Ryder on Cancer Surgery Sports Night star Steve also explained his biopsy results came the day after he went on a charity walk in memory of late BBC presenter Bill Turnbull, who died of prostate cancer in September 2022. Steve recalled, I went in and they said I need to be operated on as soon as possible and to clear the diary for the next three weeks. It is all contained within the prostate, so it gives us the opportunity to have significant surgery and cure the whole thing that way. If it becomes more advanced, the future is a little bit more bleak for people. We have managed to catch it in time that surgery will really knock it its head. That's the message out there right now. I've been so lucky. Social media users react many viewers watching Steve on BBC Breakfast sent him best wishes on Twitter for his recovery. There was also a lot of gratitude sent Steve's way for opening up about his condition and raising awareness about prostate cancer. Sending the very best of wishes to Steve Ryder and to all men currently going through the prostate cancer journey, one person tweeted. Another Twitter user posted, Thank you Steve for getting the message out. And a third echoed that remark, writing, Thank you talking about silent killer. The more we get men checked better, even if no signs. So get checked, men.